Welcome to Blacksight Tutorials. To start off, you need to get your gun model, it can be from anywhere, or from this website. You will also need this website Photopea, so you can create the color of the wireframe. And this website Conversio, you will convert your color PNG to a DDS file here. Now you need to create this folder setup like I have. You will save your textures in the DDS folder. Now add your gunmodels.ydr file and mag.ydr file to the XML2 codewalker folder like I have. And now open codewalker RPF Explorer, link in description for install. Then open the XML to codewalker folder like I do. Now enter edit mode. Then right click on both YDR files and click export XML and export them to the .xml folder you created. Now open Blender 4.0. Then delete the current scene by clicking A, then delete key. Now import your gun model using the Solemns plugin tool by clicking the arrow on the right side like I did. Link in description to install the tool. Then go to the .xml folder and click on your gun XML file and import it. Now zoom in on your gun, then click the eye in the scene on the right next to the gun model to hide the bones, then click hide collisions. Then click your gun and go to the modifiers tab on the right like I do. Then click add modifier and search for wireframe like I do. Once you click it, it will look crazy. Just uncheck the box even. And then set the thickness to 0 0.001. Here is the wireframe. Now click apply. Now we can add color to it. Go to the Materials tab like I do. Then go to the Solemns tool and go to Drawables, then Shader Tools. And expand the tool, then click the drop-down to search for Normal Spec Emissive. This will give the wireframe glow. If you don't want glow, then search for Normal Spec. Then click the shader and then click create shader material. And then rename the material. Then scroll down to Solemns, then open the texture parameters. Open the first texture and add your DDS file you created for your color. And then switch to the material preview. At the top right it will look like a globe. 
Then you can delete the other two textures, as you won't set anything for them. Now go to Value Parameters and copy these settings for the glow only. Then scroll up to the materials and click tab on your keyboard to enter edit mode. Then click A to select the gun and go to the materials tab and make sure you are on the new material then click assign and this will add the color. And then go to the scene and unhide the bones by clicking the eye next to the gun. Then click A to select everything then go to Solemn's tool and export. Then export it to the .export folder. Now close Blender and open the export folder in both the RPF Explorer and in the .export folder. Then drag the new XML file over to the RPF Explorer and this will make it a .ydr file. Now you need to do the same thing to the mag, if you want it to be wireframe. If not, then skip this part. Now that we have both .ydr files, we need to create their .ytd files. Right click and rename the .ydr and copy the name before the .ydr part. Then right click a empty space and go to new then created a .ytd file and paste the name you copied. Open the file and add the DDS texture color you created earlier then click the save button. And then do the same exact thing for the Mac. And then open open for and drag the files from CodeWalker over. And here is the gun. The glow will only show in game. Let's check it out. Congratulations. You have created your first wireframe gun using Black Sight Tutorials. For more exclusive tutorials and the full how-to video join my Discord. Like in description and comments.